Katie Price's mom, Amy Price, has confessed that her daughter's downward spiral was born after her alleged sexual assault in 2018. Amy, 71, who is a proud mom to daughters Katie, 45, and Sophie, 35, opened up about the lasting effects of the reported attack in her new tell-all book, The Last Word. Former glamour model Katie previously shared terrifying details of the sexual assault she went through in South Africa, while a gun was held to her head. The incident took place in March 2018, when the mom of five was with her son Junior, 18, and daughter Princess, 15, while filming for her reality TV show, My Crazy Life, in South Africa. Katie previously revealed that she was filming the show without any security at the time, and their vehicle ended up being carjacked by four thieves, one of whom reportedly sexually assaulted Katie. Following a safari trip, which everyone had enjoyed, the production company decided to try to cross the border into Swaziland at a time of day that wasn't safe, along a road that wasn't safe, Amy penned in her tell-all book. They were then attacked by four robbers, she added. In her tell-all book, Amy revealed that she thinks the horrifying incident in South Africa sparked a downward spiral in Katie, which she says led to a suicide attempt. It would be easy to pinpoint the beginning of Kate's downward spiral to the carjacking fiasco. A few months after the traumatic incident, one of Kate's friends rang me to say they had found her trying to kill herself, Katie's mum penned, according to The Sun. Katie's return from South Africa saw her mental health deteriorate. Amy said she wished she could have spotted the patterns in Kate's life in a bid to help stray from being controlled by husbands, boyfriends and managers who she claims are always close to the former glamour model for their own benefit. Katie, who previously spent time in the Priory to deal with post-traumatic stress disorder following the attack, previously said what happened in South Africa has had a lasting effect on her family. I can't even tell you how traumatic it was. We all thought we were going to die, she said on Loose Women back in 2021. Katie also spoke about how she tried to protect her children during the scary ordeal. I was holding the pillow up waiting to be shot to protect my children. While a lot of the documentary crew went home because they couldn't deal with what had happened, Katie carried on filming. If you've been a victim of sexual assault, you can access help and resources via www.rapecrisis.org.uk or calling the National Telephone Helpline on 0808. 802-9999 or if you are struggling and need to talk, the Samaritans operate a free helpline open 24-7 on 116-123. Alternatively, you can email joe at samaritans.org or visit their site to find your local branch.